Hey guys, it's Jeff Chan from Memory Shredded, and I'm here with my cousin Van. Today we are going to be showing you how to use the K guard slash the matrix to defend against punches when we are on the ground. So when we're in bottom guard, the first thing we want to do is break our opponent's posture because this, my opponent wants to posture to strike. Dang. So when they go to strike, I can use my legs and bring my head off center line and pull them down so that now I have an arm locked and they can't punch me. Now my opponent's not just going to sit there, he's going to try to posture up and strike. And notice how he's lifting his left leg up for more balance because if he stays on his knees and he punches me again, I'm just going to use my legs to keep bringing his posture. So watch, Van's going to try to keep his balance and punch while he's on his knees. I can constantly, continually break his posture because he's on his knees. So what he wants to do is step one leg up. Now he's got that bounce. So watch, if I try to pull him down with his legs, he can use his hand and his leg to help bounce. So as soon as he lifts his leg up, we're going to transition into what we call the K guard. So from here, I'm gonna use my closest arm to hook that leg and I'm gonna go palm on palm. As I turn my knee towards the ground. So this is called the K guard because we're essentially making a K with the body. So I wanna go palm on palm and drive that knee towards the floor and I want my ankle to hook the top of the thigh. From here, I want to use my left leg and I want to create a big circle. I want to draw a circle, swing it, and I want to kick into the armpit. I want to kick him down and break his posture. Of course, he's not just going to let me kick him back. He's going to try to come close towards me. If I don't use my hands to, to turn the knee, he's going to be nice and strong here. So from here, I want to use his leg to keep him back. So I'm kind of like leg pressing him. And I'm going to use my hands and I'm going to turn the knee inwards. From here, I'm going to now chop the leg behind the knee. This position is called matrix. So again, my opponent steps his leg up. I'm going to defend the punch by catching the bicep. My closest arm is going to hook under the leg as I shrimp out and turn into a ball. I'm going to go palm on palm. I'm going to swing this leg up and try to kick the armpit back. Of course, he's not just going to fall over, he's going to try to come forward. I'm going to use my palm on palm grip to turn the knee inwards and I'm going to use this leg and chop right behind the knee. And from here, I'm going to use my leg to hook so he can't run. Now I'm going to grab his right leg and now i got both butterfly hooks from behind. So as I'm hooking, I can sit up, pull him back and kick and extend the legs and take the back. The sweat, the swelling as well. Sorry. No, it's okay, Mark. My opponent stands up, I block the punch, I scoop and transition to the Gegar. Now from here, notice my opponent stood up onto both feet. So I'm going to continue, palm on palm, turn the knee in. I'm going to swing this leg up, up and around, and I'm going to 
weave my leg in between his two legs. From here, I'm gonna try to turn him. Now, I'm gonna tuck the foot underneath my armpit. I'm gonna get the knee bar. So again, my opponent stands up. I'm gonna block that punch. Scoop that leg. Transition to K-guard. Now from here, if my opponent tries to punch me, I can block with my shin, and hopefully, I can go fast enough to kick that leg up and through. See how I'm upside down. Now I'm gonna use my left thigh to try to break him down, roll him over. Now I have his legs caught. I'm gonna tuck his foot in the armpit and into that knee bar. My opponent stands up, punches, I'm gonna catch. Scoop, get into K-guard. Now he stands up. So as I turn the knee down to the floor, I'm gonna swing this leg up and weave it through his thigh. Kick him down and watch. From here, I'm gonna tuck the foot underneath the armpit. And now I'm gonna hit forward to get the knee bar. 30 seconds. When we go for the K-guard, my opponent doesn't want anything to do with this leg entanglement, so he pulls his leg straight up and just disengages. So again, my opponent steps his foot up, I'm gonna block, transition to the K-guard, and I'm gonna try to go for it, but he pulls his leg straight up. Now, I'm gonna sit up, technical lift, stand up. 